what we call this girls construction camp started relative to House Bill 5 when students in the eighth grade had to choose an endorsement and we thought it might be advantageous for a young lady in the eighth grade to come out and see what a day in the world of construction is. Females have made great strides in entering our area of construction and we thought we wanted to let them know they're clearly welcome and available to come into the world of construction. Give them a lot of opportunity to see different types of crafts for their career options. They'll be doing scaffold building, drywall. They're gonna run a carry deck crane. They'll be in a man lift. And they'll be doing pipe fitting. And then they also, we have a section on engineering where they go through construction documents and learn a lot about safety and what it takes as a team to build a project. I see myself in the construction field, one, because my whole family works for TNT Crane and Rigging, like everybody in my family, so I'm going to do that, and then, I don't know, I just enjoy it. I think it's important for students in the eighth grade, our female students, to learn about uh, career options in a construction world because I don't believe most parents would steer or guide their daughters into the world of construction. We have volunteers here today that are very successful from engineers to crafts personnel, safety supervisors. They're all very successful as professionals in the construction world. And we believe if you, you know, don't educate these young ladies and make them aware, they'll be guided into a, a career that is probably more traditional uh, for guiding a young lady. Uh, not necessarily in an underrepresented population such as females in the world of construction.